there is more to know about Jose Sal than what you have learned in history class. To feed your curiosity, there are outstanding facts about our national hero that you probably didn't know about. And one of them is the animal species renamed after him. Guys, bit of trivia for you. Did you know that when Dr. Jose Rizal was exiled in the Pitan, he discovered the flying lizard and sent a specimen to the Anthropological and Ethnographical Museum of Dresden in Germany. Now, all this was, of course, in exchange for scientific books, magazines. In praises for this rare species he discovered, the European scientist named the lizard Draco Rizali in his honor. Pretty cool, right? imagination niya, na-discover niya habang na nasa exile siya sa Dapitan. Nakita niya tong lizard na to. Pinadala niya to sa Europa. Hindi ako nagkakamali. At uh, yung mga formally na nag-describe nitong lizard na to ay pinangalan sa kanya. The flying dragon, also known as Draco Lizard, has a set of elongated ribs that support folds of skin on the sides of its body, which act as wings when unfurled, allowing the Draco to catch the wind and glide. Importante siya sa ecosystem natin dahil kinokontrol niya yung peste. Lalo-lalo na ngayon, 
apektado yung mga coconuts natin ng mga insekto na kinakain yung mga dahon. It's an amazing adaptation. Doon mo nga makikita talaga how amazing yung evolution at work because of competition for food and for territory. So para makakover siya ng mas malaking ground, is, uh, nagkaroon siya ng adaptation na makalipad kahit panandalian lang. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen, our top 10 ang pinaka hanep na hayop ng Pilipinas 2014. Ladies and gentlemen, please let us do whatever we can to help preserve and protect our rich biodiversity. Basically, that means stop eating the animals.